What royal rules will Meghan Markle break after baby Sussex is born? If the reports are accurate, baby Sussex is due to greet the world at the end of April or the beginning of May. The world is on pins and needles waiting to catch a glimpse of the new royal. While all royal baby announcements get full attention, this one is different. From the start, people have been fascinated by Meghan Markle. Prince Harry has been breaking royal traditions from the beginning of their relationship leaving many people to wonder what else will change. While Kate Middleton has made every attempt to stick with traditions, Markle seems to be less conservative. It's this quality that likely grabbed Prince Harry's attention in the first place. So, what royal rules can we assume Meghan Markle will break after baby Sussex is born? The rules Prince Harry broke with Meghan Markle The most obvious royal rule or tradition that Prince Harry broke when he began his relationship to Markle is her status. She did not come from any royal bloodline or posh family like Kate Middleton did. She was an American actress. According to Marie Claire, this breaks the mold for the royal family in so many ways. On top of being American, she was also previously married and divorced. The law that forbade royals from marrying people who have been divorced has been changed making it legal. However, it is still frowned upon in many circles. Not that that seems to matter to either one of them. Believe it or not. There are rules against royal couples holding hands in public. This royal rule may sound completely foreign to us regular folks, but it exists. Not that we blame Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, but they most definitely break this royal rule. Royal rules Meghan Markle has broken thus far. There are very specific rules that royal women are supposed to follow when they are pregnant. While Meghan Markle has done her best to follow most of them, there are some royal rules that she has broken. To start with, she decided to have a baby shower. For most American women, a baby shower is a rite of passage. For royals, it is in bad taste. The idea that a member of the royal family would accept gifts and be showered is traditionally out of the question. Not for Markle, she had a shower in New York. Another rule she has sidestepped is the one that says pregnant royals are not allowed to travel abroad. On top of flying to New York for her baby shower, she has also accompanied her husband several times on royal duty trips abroad, even though she was pregnant at the time. There are also strict rules on what she should wear while expecting. Like Kate Middleton did with her pregnancies, Markle is supposed to wear loose clothing, close-toed shoes, and stay conservatively covered up. Already, we have seen Markle break all these wardrobe rules, and wear what makes her comfortable. Rules Meghan Markle will break after baby Sussex is born. Some royal rules we have heard she might break once baby Sussex arrives also has a lot to do with American versus English traditions. For starters, Markle has suggested that she may want to have a natural home birth. If that happens, she won't have her baby at the same hospital that royal women have been using for decades. If Markle decides to give birth at home, it is unlikely that she will pose outside the maternity ward, like Kate Middleton and Princess Diana before her. She has expressed concern about the stress of needing to look picture-perfect so soon after giving birth. She would rather spend that time bonding with her bundle of joy. Speaking of her bundle of joy, she is considering breaking the royal rules for name-choosing. According to Stylecaster, Markle and Prince Harry are thinking about naming the baby Diana if possible. Traditionally royal babies are named after former British monarchs. Of all the royals we have seen, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are the most independent. They seem to have made it their goal to change things up and pave the way for more modern traditions. And, we can't wait to see what happens when baby Sussex arrives.